we take a drop of blood and we looking at the quality of the blood. So the quality was observed before and after we used this technology. And then I put it on the TV screen mm. right there so you could see what's going on. So it definitely a room for improvement here. Yeah. Okay. So we see two things. Number one, it's the it's you know that your blood should have enough of electric charge that when the two cells come close together they should bump one of the other yeah they should not come and stick together oh, like nice. this So definitely we see a change in electrolytes. You could see that. Yeah, it definitely gives you some electric spark between your cells. You can see them much more separated. You can see a much better picture here. So you could see them better. Yeah, you could see actually quite a differences between your sizes because you see them much more separated. You can definitely see a difference, but I'm, I mean, the important thing is that you actually see much better um, spark between you. Look at this white blood cell. Just watch it for a little while. This white blood cell will move. But just concentrate on that and you will see it's called viability of the white blood cells. They're definitely more viable. You, you could see them moving and, and look, look how it's changing the shape. Yeah. So that viability for sure improved as well. Uh -huh. Or look at this one. Uh -huh. I keep the finger. Yeah. Look at how it's moving. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Oh, yeah. Oh, it's going to yeah. yeah. Right. So we didn't see that viability. Uh -huh. When I go towards the edges, I still see the lymphatic ring. But I have to admit, it's not as big. You, you see, this is called healing. If you actually start, this was open before, and now we, we still see it's whitish, but it's filling up. Yeah. It's filling up. So there's less? It's definitely less. Yeah.